the way we did things at SpaceX was find the limits, run it hotter, run it higher pressure, you know, try to get the most out of it. Find out what breaks, fix that, and then go even higher. My name is Tom Mueller. I've been a rocket propulsion development engineer for 35 years, and I'm the founder and CEO of Impulse Space. When I started in 1985, El Segundo back then was like the big aerospace, Raytheon, you know, Boeing Space Systems, and all these other uh, aerospace companies. When we started SpaceX, Elon said, we're gonna have the building somewhere right here in the South Bay. This is the place to hire talent. There was three of us, and we found this building, 1310 East Grand Avenue, just a few blocks away from here. El Segundo was a perfect spot. We built the, the very first um, development stage of the Falcon 9 in that building. I was at SpaceX for 18 years. The cost of access to space has come down a tremendous amount. We're developing spacecraft that can move those things to higher energy orbits, to, to different orbits, to the moon, to Mars, to any other bodies in the solar system. It's, it's hard to say how big that, that market is or how big SpaceX could become, or how big, for that matter, Impulse Space could become. Being close to the beach is a draw for talent. People want to live here. Being close to LAX is really nice. And the engineering talent base here, the schools here, it's just uh, it's a perfect place for doing aerospace. I always say you couldn't throw a rock here in El Segundo without hitting a, you know, another SpaceX founded company. Both Varda and ABL are potential customers or partners. Radiance just right, right over here. Another huge plus to this area is, is, is having the Air Force Base here and Space Force right here so it's easy to interact with them it helps a lot to have have that that government customers and help so close so yeah uh, a lot of interaction between these various companies when we started spacex it was a completely different vibe than it is now because aerospace as a tech company was brand new traditional aerospace is pretty risk adverse we had to kind of train them the, the SpaceX way, like run it hard, break it, fix it, get it reliable, get it very efficient. The rocket is industry leading because of the run it hotter mentality. Everybody that we had early on, because they had equity in the company, was excited about it and motivated and we worked long hours and, and achieved a lot. Just proving that ownership of the company is the right, right way to succeed. El Segundo brought in more um, high-tech industry. A lot of us believe that we will become a spacefaring civilization. Right now, the space industry is like single-digit percent of the global economy. If it's gonna become a major part of the global economy, that goes very well for El Segundo. Mm -hmm.